In order to approach question number 39, I'm going to do a lot of marking of the triangles and then erasing when I go to the next problem. Uh, starting with uh, uh, portion A, I'm going to mark AB is congruent to EF. That gives me a side. Uh, AC is congruent to DF. That gives me another side. And angle A is congruent to angle F, which gives me an angle. Now, by just reading the directions, you might think that this is the bad word and thus does not work. However, if you look at the pictures, this is side, angle, side congruence. And if you check on the other one, you find it the same thing. So this is true. The triangles are congruent by side, side, oops, side, angle, side. 39B. Uh, the first thing I'm going to mark is angle A is congruent to angle F. Angle B is congruent to angle E. And angle C is congruent to angle, oops, angle C is congruent to angle B. D, <laughs> unfortunately, this is A, 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 which is not a congruence postulate. So these, ang these triangles are not congruent. Thirty-nine C. Uh, angle A is congruent to angle F. Angle B is congruent to angle E. And line segment AB is congruent to line segment EF. That to me looks like angle side angle, and that to me sounds like two congruent triangles. All right, thirty-nine D. AB is congruent to EF. Uh, AC is congruent to DF. And BC is congruent to DE. That is side, side, side. 39E. BC is congruent to DE. AC is congruent to DF. And angle B is congruent to angle E. That to me looks like a bad word, and that is not congruent. Last one. Angle C is congruent to D. Angle A is congruent to angle F. And side AB is congruent to EF. That looks like angle, angle, side. So to summarize, uh, E and B are not congruent, and A, C, D, and F are congruent.